Hey YouTube, it's Sean Griffin RC Planes. Welcome to my new uh, setup for you guys. I've got the iX12 screens projected up on this TV. Don't worry, you'll get a better shot of it when we get to that point. And I'm going to use this as a test run, a learning run. And uh, I'm already thinking about some changes I want to make. I'm thinking I'm going to bring that TV down a little bit. Or I might move these shelves over a little bit so that I can use that, uh, you know, the mount where you can you, know, you can move this thing all around and maybe bring it in a little more or something. I'm just playing with it and trying to figure it out. And we'll just do a real quick demonstration on stick priority for the AS3X gyro inside the Spectrum receivers of forward programming or the AR636 receivers with your Spectrum PC programmer or the app that you use on your smartphone or tablet or iPad. So Spectrum has the stick priority set at 200 being the highest. It comes default setting at 160. If you had your stick priority set to 200, the second you touched your stick, the gyro would not help you anymore. So being set at 160 allows you to move your stick 40% of its travel and once you got to 41%, the gyro would not help you anymore. Meaning, stabilize the plane. This is not safe. This is the gyro, AS3X. However, it's on a sliding scale. So the closer you get to 40% of your stick travel, and that's 160 priority, the gyro gets weaker, okay? So if you were if it's set at 160 and you were at 35%, so you still got 5% to go before it stops helping, then the gyro would only be helping at like, you know, 10% of its potential. All right, so real quick, and then I'll focus the camera on the plane and the monitor. But we have our AS3X going, and I've got the game set wide open so that we can see it and hear it. You can look at the red and green aileron and probably see him just flapping. And I'll barely touch the, the ailerons and then I'll slowly get it over to 40% and you'll hear it stop working and it get weaker. So, not touching the stick, now I'm touching it a little bit. A little bit more, a little bit more, a little bit. That's about 40%, they're done. Gyro's not helping anymore. What you hear is the rudder and elevator. We're not touching those control surfaces yet, so they're not being affected. Let's uh, show you some stuff on the TV. Brutus says, subscribe. Okay, 160 is the default setting for priority with the, the gyro helping us, the AS3X. So, we can hear the AS3X helping us right now. I'm not touching the transmitter. Watch the red and the green eddy you can see you can see the gyro growing crazy trying to help you. it's set at 160 the default value take a look at here at the monitor screen the ailerons i'm going to slowly move the stick over until it gets to about 40 percent of the travel and you will be able to hear the gyro slowly not helping you all right watch the aileron up here Once I get to 40, it's done. What you, what you hear is the rudder around the elevator. Look at the ailerons are stuck. Just like you guys remember before the gyro days. I'm holding the stick and there it is. They're not moving. Let's change the setting real quick to maybe 199 or something to see what it looks like. Gyro settings, AS3X, priority, change the roll rate. We'll take it to uh, 198, okay, okay, and okay, and okay. I'm gonna get a warning. I've got that warning because when you go into forward programming and come back out, you lose the RF signal for a second, so that's one, you know, one, one loss, one hold or whatever. 
So, here's our gyro going. We're not touching the sticks, not touching the sticks. I'm going to barely touch it. Watch your earlier on. Look, you got the six or seven is dead. So, there's your priority. Well, all right, guys, so that's a little test run. Look at that guy. <laughs> that's all right. I'm going to do a little learning with this and, and uh, a little rearranging of things. And don't worry, nothing's going to happen anytime soon. I still got to figure out how to, how to operate the IX-12 all the way. So, But it gives me a little TV to watch also while I'm, while I'm fiddling. Okay, guys, hey, thank you. If, uh, if you're new to this channel and you haven't subscribed, please do. It would mean a whole lot to me. All right, guys. Hey, till next time, you see me here.